Hi everyone! So today's video is a spring lookbook. So loads of you have been requesting this video for a little while now and I really love making lookbooks so this will be my second lookbook that I've made. So I'm going to go through just a couple of my favourite looks for spring and I hope it inspires you for your fashion, your hair and your makeup. So for all the looks today on my face I have Maybelline Lash, Lash Sensational Mascara and Urban Decay Naked Skin Foundation and that's all I have, <laughs> yeah. And I've got also EOS Strawberry Lip Balm, it's a good one. So let's get on with the video. This first look is like a romantic beach kind of look so really pretty romantic look and for this I am going to be scrunching up my hair into like beachy waves and just adding a bit of sparkle to my face. So first I'm going to be using pink surfs up beach wave spray so basically you just want to take your hair, I'm using a mirror here by the way, and you want to spray it onto the ends. Spray it all over the ends of the hair. Then you want to use your hands and just scrunch the ends up. As if you're kind of tangling your hair, but it won't tangle. Just really like, play with the hair. And if you need to, you can add some more. You want to tassel it as well, it's kind of nice. Just go like this, like here. So after it's created a bit like volume, beachy waves, um, you're then going to have, then going to put on this kind of, it's like Michael Jackson hat, boom. And I just wanna kind of volumize this bit so you can pull it up a bit, like that. And it will just make it a little bit like, not messy, but kind of, beachy. So now I've got like really like lion curls. It's kind of like I've just been in the water and just come out of the sea. Then you want to get your hat. So this is from Claire's Accessories. I got this last year but they still sell similar hats now so you just want to put that on your head. I think it looks really cute and I just like it. It looks really springy. Then the next thing on my face is I'm going to be using Urban Decay Naked Illuminated Aura Shimmering Powder for face and body. So it's really shiny. So you grab the brush, like so, and you just dash it all over the head. Can I create like a really romantic shimmer after you've done that so when you go into the light it's going to like reflect it looks really pretty so then I'm going to be putting on model zone Madame Rose lip gloss this is absolute my fave and you just put on some lip balm so I've used EOS strawberry lip balm on my lips to smoothen them out leave it for about 10 minutes and they go totally really soft I think it's a really romantic and pretty colour. Now let's get into the look. So now we're moving on to look two and this is a more casual look for a nice 
spring evening and I love this look so much and I really hope you like it too. So for hair we are going to be putting our hair up into a high messy bun with a cute bandana to finish it. It looks really nice and I hope you like it. So what you want to do is get your hair and you want to brush it back like this to smoothen out all knots and then pull it up that looks quite cute up into like a high ponytail so it's like right on the top of your head try and put it as high as you can so I'm putting it there on my head but then you're going to get your tangle teaser and you're going to brush the back bit up to smoothen it out so as you can see I've got this thing there which is like so what you want to do is if you've got bits like that, so this bit sticking up, grab a back comb and you want to bring it back and it really neatens it out. It's gone. You're then going to throw your head forward like this, grab your tangle teaser and you're going to kind of push it upwards you can use the beach spray beach spray it then scrunch it this just gives it so much volume so as you can see it's really quite something it's like a monster you grab all the hair and you loosely twist it like that and then run it around to create that yeah then grab your, another hair tie which I've got on my wrist and tie it round once or twice depending on your hair type and you should end up with a massive thing like that so now we've got our bun we're then going to get some bobby pins I'm not sure you can see it but some bobby pins and you just want to pin in the less secure bits not all of it because you don't want it looking quite tight you want it looking quite messy and loose so so you should have that it looks really cute and ignore the little bits that are poking out you can tuck them into the middle if you want but I kind of like them just sitting there kind of loosely because they make the look a bit more messy bun than. then you can use your back comb and you can back comb the bits that are sticking out and this just smoothens it but don't you use it sideways so go up sideways and then if you want you can either use a scrunchie or I've got a kind of like bow it's like a bow hair tie and you can put it over the hair so you want to stretch it out real far so you're going to take the hair tie and you're going to put it so then the rib, the bow is at the back if you've got a bowed one then put the bow at the back put it round the hair it also neatens it up a little at the bottom which is kind of needed and then you've got this it's really cute then grab a bandana so then it's really long so you want to roll it like that not really neatly but tightly so then when it goes around the head it's not messy so take this like that and then put it up over the head and take this here underneath the tie and secure 
pull it. Then you've got that. Then you got that look. Now our hair's done, we can now accessorise our face. So I'm going to be using Model Zone Premier Plum and this is going as a gloss on my lips. So it's a bit of a darker shade to Madame Rose, but. It's really nice and I like this a lot. And there's our hair and face. Now let's go and put on our look. So I hope you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and please also subscribe to my channel for more. Have a great day everyone, bye!